Hey, hey, people. Welcome to a little extra video. Um, something that I've, um, I, I, I keep checking in with the Nintendo Switch games that are coming up and, uh, just checking out Resident Evil, obviously. Um, physical release coming with both of those together. I'm actually gonna let's play that on my channel, but that's beside the point. Um, something that I've noticed, um, at first, when I checked this, um, a little bit after the Switch's release, it wasn't really that bad. It wasn't actually, it wasn't actually that strong. But now, look, look at this. Look at the Switch games. It's quite a lot, right? And a bunch of physical releases sprinkled throughout there. These are all obviously not, um, not, uh, no, like, a, no date yet. And then look at Nintendo 3DS games. Three, three physical, that's fine. But look at how small it is. It used to have at least four lines at all times. At least. Nintendo Switch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven lines. Eleven. So, <laughs> that's a lot of freaking games coming up. And even digital. And there's so many physical releases in here. Like a one, two, we got three, four, five, um... Yeah, there's a bunch of here, like six. Runner, I think, is gonna be a uh, physical seven. Kirby, eight. And uh, Wolfenstein, and also Kurt, uh, Yoshi. So that's at least 10 physical releases that are already announced. With the, uh, with the Nintendo 3DS being, like, left behind. <laughs> um, with mainly uh, digital releases, which are also coming out for. Um, all the most of the digital releases are coming out for the for the Nintendo Switch as well. Also for the Wii U, for example, Shovel Knight and uh, Shovel Knight. So it's coming out on every system. The Wii U obviously not getting any more physical releases because that's over. But yeah, there's a lot of people that were saying that uh, Nintendo is gonna drop the 3DS and uh, solely focus on the Nintendo Switch or bring out a like, a like a Switch Mini that they're gonna substitute for their dedicated handheld console. And I, I didn't wanna believe it, but this is really pointing towards that. I, I agree with the idea, but I don't agree that Nintendo would do such a thing. Merely what I thought was because the Nintendo 3DS family has gone on for um, so long now, and including just uh, including the DS family, it's gone on longer than Game Boy. So what I think is that it's not going to be a cancellation of the uh, 3DS, and also that the next the next handheld, because there is going to be one, the next handheld is not going to be the Ninten new Nintendo 3DS 2 or something. It's going to be something completely different. It's going to be going from the Nintendo 3DS to, hey, it could be a Switch Mini. I mean, I wouldn't be against the idea, you know, having having a smaller version of the Switch without the whole Joy-Con and docking thing, but merely a one-screened uh, HD, maybe 720p, finally, uh, with uh, smaller cartridges and just same games. Alright, thank you very much for watching. This was just a little update video. So, see you guys next week for new videos. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I, did I already say that? I don't even know. <laughs> Bye.